This is so cute. Good morning. So right now I'm at Dunkin Donuts. They have this cute pink drink and I thought it was perfect for Valentine's Day. It's called an iced pink velvet macchiato and I added some whipped cream on top. Okay, I'm gonna try it. It's good, I like it. I never know if I'm supposed to like stir these. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to like stir it all together, but I'm afraid to lose the pink part of it. So whenever they have like cute colorful drinks, I never stir them. I just, I just drink them how they are. But this morning I'm gonna be spending some time in Winter Garden. Me and Ariana live in Orlando and Valentine's Day is coming up. Oh, I just realized that my camera was like shaking on the dashboard, so sorry if it was making like a noise. Winter Garden has a town center that basically looks like a city from a romantic comedy, like a really cute walkable city from a rom-com. That's what it reminds me of. So I'm gonna spend some time there this morning. Also, I'm going to Disney Springs today because me and Ariana wanna start decorating for spring. And Disney Springs has Disney home decor. They have an anthropology. Yeah, I'm just gonna be romanticizing my life this morning. Oh, also, also I got a heart-shaped donut. Oh, this is so cute. Yeah, I got a heart-shaped donut. It's adorable. I have no idea um, what the frosting is inside. They had this one and a brownie one. The brownie one was really good. I got it last year. Yeah, it's so cute. So I'm gonna have my breakfast and head to Winter Garden. Well, technically I'm already in Winter Garden. <laughs> Okay, I made it to Disney Springs and I'm about to go into the world of Disney Store. I got distracted by the plushies. Look at this Pegasus. That is so cute. Oh, and they're playing Hercules. Oh my gosh. They have the Valentine's Day ears. Oh my goodness. Pink is my favorite color of all time. These are pretty. I found these Cinderella ears. I'm loving all the Disney princess themed ears and I love the bow. They have a clock. I want to see if I can find some spring home decor. So I'm going to go into the co-op next. They have this, I think it's an Epcot cookie jar. I'm pretty sure it's a cookie jar. They also have one of the Magic Kingdom castle. I'm going back to get the Valentine's Day ears. They're just too cute. I came back into the world of Disney store to get the Valentine's Day ears and they have this Jack and Sally Valentine's Day shirt and it says simply meant to be. I got the ears. They were just too cute. Now I'm going into anthropology because I wanna see what spring home items they have. But first I'm actually gonna go into the Disney themed jewelry store because they have Disney princess themed jewelry and it is so cute. So I'm gonna go in there and then anthropology. I'm back in the car, but I got the ears. They're so cute. I didn't know if I'd find these. They're perfect for Valentine's Day. 
sometime this weekend I plan on going to the Grand Floridian. It's a Disney resort and they also have a basin store. They have the cutest heart shape like soaps and stuff during the Valentine's Day season. And when I get home I'm gonna get comfy and I plan on baking and watching some romantic comedies this weekend. So those are my plans for the weekend. Oh I made a list of movies I want to watch for Valentine's Day. I put it in my notes app. I want to watch the Lizzie McGuire movie, Bring It On, 10 Things I Hate About You, Never Been Kissed, I love Drew Barrymore, 13 Going On 30, Cinderella, Ariana's brother got us a Cinderella VHS tape. I'm really excited because I love watching VHS tapes. Barbie and the Nutcracker, which he also got on VHS tape. Ever After, Princess Diaries 1 and 2, A Cinderella Story, Hello Dolly, and basically every movie I think of that I want to watch for Valentine's Day, I just keep adding it to the list. It's such a pretty day out. I'm gonna ride with the windows down, listen to music, get something to eat. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good morning. So today is Saturday and right now we're at the thrift store. We're actually at the Goodwill closest to Disney World. Ariana's here looking for sweatshirts and then I have to go to Target for a curbside pickup and then we're gonna go to Wingstop and get some lunch. Oh, I'm also gonna bake some Valentine's Day themed stuff today and I'm gonna watch some romantic comedies since Valentine's Day is coming up. I'm really excited to bake and watch movies. I love, that's like my favorite thing to do on the weekend. I'm about to go into Goodwill. Got my Lizzie McGuire mask. Obsessed with the show. Obsessed. I've been looking for something like this to put by the door. I think it would be so cute if we painted it and we could change the knobs. They have like these bow knobs or some gold knobs. I think that would be so adorable. It's $12.99. Ariana found this. It looks like a 90s Barbie trunk. I love 90s Barbie. I think that's 90s Barbie. It's from 1992. They have a Sharpay doll. Ariana found a Universal Studios mug from 1995. They have this Disney character hair tie set and each one has a different Disney character on it. My personal favorite was Daisy. Ariana found this adorable castle picture frame. We're leaving Goodwill. We went back to Dunkin'. This time I customized my drink. It was cheaper. I actually got this for free because the app, but it's cheaper to make the iced coffee and the whole thing is pink. Ariana got the brownie batter shaped donut. And now we're going to a new development neighborhood. It's by a builder that I really like. They make like really vintage looking homes. So we're heading over there. We just made it to the neighborhood. I love these homes so much. They look vintage, but new. They look like cute vintage craftsman homes. I think they're adorable. We're going into Target. I found this cute pink hoodie. They also have these shorts so you could do a matching set. This yellow set, this looks so comfy and it has matching shorts. Ariana just tricked me into thinking I left my phone at the store. She watched me literally panic for a long time and then was like, I have your phone. I'm excited to bake tonight and watch romantic comedies. I cleaned out the pantry and that's just been the most exciting thing for some reason. This is what I'm making tonight. I'm making Valentine's Day cupcakes and I'm gonna use this icing. I'm also making double decker cookies tonight with these Valentine's Day themed cookies. I made some for Halloween and Christmas, so I thought I'd do some for Valentine's Day. But yeah, I'm excited to bake and watch some rom-coms. We got Wingstop, lemon pepper, hot fries, garlic parmesan, my favorite. It's been about an hour, an hour and a half, and I'm about to bake and watch some romantic comedies. Disney Plus has a Valentine's Day section, and the first movie I'm gonna watch is 10 Things I Hate About You. I'm gonna bake my cupcakes first. I'm excited because I also got this icing, icing that comes with sprinkles, and I was really excited. I think the sprinkles have little hearts. I'm gonna do cupcakes first and then cookies. I'm 
watching 10 Things I Hate About You Still. This is one of my favorite parts of this movie. cookie dough and then these sugar cookies Baking. I love baking. I love baking and listening to music. Tonight we're gonna watch Ayo and Debris episode of Saturday Night Live. I'm so excited. I finished the cupcakes. This is what they look like. I think they turned out cute. But yeah, love to bake. And Saturday Night Live doesn't come on until I think midnight. I'll probably game a little bit. Yeah, I'm probably gonna play a little Sims. We get like really into it. We both always like make up a storyline. I think my last story, I lived in New York City and I lived in a garden level apartment in a brownstone. But yeah, I was living my best life. I've even built Disney World in The Sims and then I go to Disney World. <laughs> We're gonna hang out, but I just want to bake a little bit. And I think it turned out really cute. I'm making coffee, like a Dalgona style. I just got Bridgerton coffee creamer. So she's going to make the coffee with that, but I love that it came in a pink bottle. A million out of ten. It was really good. morning right now i'm on my way to the grand floridian to go to basin and usually they do valentine's day themed soaps so i'm headed over there to see if i can find anything also i got my pink jacket from target i'm glad i did because it is really chilly and it's like windy so it's the perfect day to wear it the polynesian resort is one of me and ariana's dream disney stays it's so pretty here the funniest thing just happened. While I was at the Grand Floridian, I found out that the Basin at Disney Springs opens today. I'm pretty sure if I understood right. So I'm headed to Disney Springs because theirs just opened today and I really want to see it. Also, I lost my car, but as soon as I find it, I'm going to Disney Springs. Uh-oh, this means I'm not close. <laughs> oh, found it. Now I'm going to Disney Springs. I'm at the World of Disney store and I found these Snow White ears. I love how they're doing all these Disney princess ears. They're so cute. They have these Disney princess bath bomb sets. They have Disney Princess body butter. That is so cool. Good morning. I'm about to make a ribbon tote bag. I'll put in a picture here of what it looks like. This is the tote bag I'm gonna use. I got it from Walmart. I think it was like three or four dollars. And then this is the ribbon that I'm gonna use. I'm just gonna make little bows on the tote bag. Before I get started on my tote bag, I wanted to mention I also made more cupcakes this morning and this time I put these cherry heart sprinkles on them 
and they turned out so cute. But I'm about to get started on my tote bag. This is how the tote bag turned out. I love it, I think it's so cute. There it is, I love the way it turns out. I'm pretty sure in total I spent, I think this was $4 and the ribbon was like $2. Maybe like $6 to make this. I think this is so cute. I was looking for a tote bag to put my camera in when I go to the parks. Oh, also I'm going to Epcot tonight. Epcot has Festival of the Arts right now and they do the Broadway concert series. So I'm gonna go to one of the concerts. So I'm about to make dinner real quick and then head to Epcot and have like a quick night trip. I made it to Epcot. I'm here to do the Disney on Broadway concert series. I'm gonna try to get a close seat. Also, I brought out the fluffy jacket tonight because it's kind of chilly. <laughs> I brought my camera just in case I was able to get a close seat, and I'm so glad I did. Please welcome the stars of Disney on Broadway's The Lion King and Tarzan, Kissy Simmons and Josh Strickland. Um, I was living in New York City, working at Abercrombie and Fitch. I have folding clothes, but also spraying fierce everywhere for the customers giving headaches, and I promise you, you probably can still smell it, can't you? It's taking phone calls from my manager, and uh, he told me that Disney on Broadway was developing a new show and that I had an audition. Well, 15 callbacks later, everybody. 15 callbacks. 15 callbacks. So I finally got that call that I was going to originate the role of Tarzan on Broadway. Thank you. I will forever be grateful and honored that Disney gave me that opportunity. I have something to believe in.
I'm leaving the concert. It was so good. I'm pretty sure their last show here is either tomorrow or Friday, but I had to see it again because it was so good. And now I'm gonna have a nice night stroll through Epcot. I'm all cozy in my jacket and it's a pretty night. I could see the Epcot ball. I'm gonna go for a nice stroll. I just got to paint on this the other day. I painted the number five. I think it was either here or I think, oh, this is where my square was, right here. I painted somewhere in that area. I also got to park super close today. There's the Epcot ball and then there's my car. Every time I do a night trip, I end up parking really close. For a second, I thought this wasn't my car. And I was like, ruh row. Now I'm watching the fireworks from my car. It's kind of like a movie drive-in, but at Disney. It's so pretty. I was hoping I would get to my car in time enough to see the fireworks. Mm -hmm. 